Hello my wonderful lazy dancers, welcome to Lazy Dance Tips, I'm Alessia. This is the 30th of December 2020. It has been a very long, weird journey that we had this year and has brought good, it's brought bad, it's brought uncertainties, but it also has brought a lot of good stuff. This is just a little message from me to you. Like I like to do every single year at the end of the year to see how much good stuff we have achieved. Remember that whenever we look for bad, Bad is always there, it's always available, and the more we look for it, the more we find it. But also, we need to remember that there is a lot of good, and we, if we want to search for good, if we want to look into the good stuff, it is available as well. There has been a lot of uncertainty throughout this year, but we managed to keep on dancing, to keep on having a beautiful time together. We held each other accountable to keep on going, keep on pushing and keep on finding that happiness every single day. And I have to thank you as well because every time I was reading all your comments, every time I was um, seeing these beautiful smiles from the other side of the screen, I was blown away and that was my energy. You know, you gave me that energy to keep on going to make you even more happy. This pandemic has really put us back and has given us a lot of thoughts and but on the other side has also given us the chance to see life under a different um, perspective. Anything that we have taken for granted for such a long time, like going for a walk in the park or meeting our friends or talking to our uh, loved ones every single day, whenever it is there, whenever it is available every single day, we take it for granted, we don't give it so much attention. But the moment that has, take, has been taken away from us, we somehow miss it. Uh, we miss the feeling, we miss uh, we feel in a cage, we miss going out, we miss all the very small things that we do every single day. And I have to give kudos to you for really pushing through this and finding, as I said before, that happiness because we can, in these situations, find happiness from other things that we do in life. Little small habits that we do every day, like cooking a beautiful meal for our partner or for ourselves or dancing for ourselves or even to just live our life a hundred percent every single day so this is my little message like I feel like a little bit like a queen today <laughs> But I really wanted to say thank you for everything that you've done. You know, talking about the bad stuff, you probably might have noticed that our little beloved Watson hasn't been in the videos for, for quite some time. And unfortunately, we have lost him a little bit of time ago. Uh, we lost him during June time. We knew it. Uh, we were in a way prepared that things were uh, going downhill for him. Let's say that he was born in the wrong in the wrong body. He had so much vitality, he had so much to give and so much uh, to teach. But unfortunately we lost him and but he's always here with us every single day. So thank you very much for everyone that has been supporting us for our little you know little loss. It's not a little loss, it's a big loss for our little fairy furry baby. But there is something that Watson has taught me and taught us for such a long time and every time I hear his meow meow going around in the home even though he's not here anymore. It didn't matter how many times the vet said he was going to live for three months. It didn't matter to him that he had a limited time. It didn't matter how much bad they said to him. He didn't know. Well, first of all, he didn't understand humans, so it probably was the best thing for him. But most of all, he lived his life 100% every single day. Like he didn't know. He didn't know he had a heart problem. He didn't know he was going to die. He didn't know he wasn't going to be here tomorrow. But what he taught me was it doesn't matter how many bad things they can tell you in life. It doesn't matter how many horrible things get thrown at you. As long as you decide that you want to live your life 100% every single day and mail around and ask for food, going meow, meow, 
you, it wasn't more of that, it was more ah. Like he used to go around ha. It was actually really funny and I still have that little voice at the back of my head. He really taught me to take every single day at 100%. So from a very nice teacher, there was my little uh, little cat Watson. Uh, what, I'm, what I'm saying to you is next year from the from today, not even from next year. Start from now. Live your life 100%. Live your life like today is the best day that's ever happened to you. And keep on going like that every single morning whenever you wake up. Live it with the joy of taking in 100% from what has been offered to you. Whether it's bad or good, take the positive out of it. I know it's, uh, it seems like a very, very philosophical kind of um, end of year video, but I really want you to say, keep on dancing because you love it. It doesn't matter who says that you can't do it. Do it because you want to do it. Keep on pushing despite people telling you that you can't. Keep on living and dancing at the best way you can and give 100% to every single step that you take in your life. With this said, thank you for all the good and even the bad comments that come around every single day. Uh, thank you for pushing me because it means that I'm doing something right and it means that I am giving you 100% of myself and Believe me, I'll never stop. I'll never stop making you dance and making you feel absolutely fantastic. So thank you for the beautiful messages and all the loving that you are giving us. Thank you for everything that you do. Thank you for being part of this amazing community of lazy dancers because as lazy dancers, we can take on the world and we can dance every single day as much as we want because we love it. With this said, I wish you a most wonderful new year and hey, go for it. It is your year and every single day, it's your day. Make all your dream, may all your dreams come true and most importantly, make them true because you are in charge and you can do it. Love you all and I love you always. Let's dance and let's keep on going.